For the last uh, three months, uh, farmers across the country have been dealing with failed rainfall, which has threatened their crops. And the weatherman now says we are not out of the woods yet, as the country is once again facing depressed rainfall. According to the Kenya Meteorological Department, deforestation in most parts of the country and a combination of natural factors have denied the country the needed and desired moisture as well as rains. We really need to look at the land use activities. Uh, what, at times when you have a lot of deforestation taking place, whatever rainfall uh, occurs goes off as runoff and therefore we don't hold any rainfall in the soil as a delayed runoff to you know, uh, recharge the rivers. Western Kenya, Nyanza and parts of North Rift regions are expected to receive good rains next month. In the western parts of the country we are likely to see uh, rainfall starting to establish in the third, fourth week of uh, next month, that's in March. But the areas where the onset will be as late as uh, the first week of April. However, Nairobi, among other counties in Central, South Rift, Eastern and Coastal region will receive below average rainfall during March through to May season. The weatherman father warns that most of the eastern sector of the country is likely to remain generally dry in March. Uh, much of the eastern half, including southeastern lowlands, northeastern Kenya, um, uh, the coastal strip, uh, the expectation is that we are going to have depressed rainfall. Uh, basically near normal to depressed rainfall in those areas. The department has cautioned that most parts of the country and more so arid and semi-arid regions, food security, limited pasture and water is expected to deteriorate due to the expected low rainfall. One, it could be as a consequence of declining rainfall patterns. Um, our analysis shows that um, if you look at the long-term um, time series, it's like the long rains are becoming less and less in quite a number of areas. According to the weather department, water levels in the hydroelectric power generation dams, the seven forks, Takwell and Sondu Miriu, will gradually improve. Diseases like cholera and malnutrition may emerge in areas expected to receive little rains, while cases of flooding in places like Budalangi and Kano Areas as well as landslides in prone areas of Western, Central and Rift Valley are also highly probable. Brenda Zedradido, Channel 1 News.